Hey, hello there, my name is Wookie and Aaron. welcome back for another round of Seven Days to Die. Uh, so I, I said I was gonna stop playing this on camera for a little while because of, um, I was just gonna do some grinding, uh, get some more levels. I've only gotten maybe two levels since the last time. Um, you guys actually saw uh, what came on camera. Um, I got a couple new things. Um, not all that much though, it's just a couple like weapon upgrades and stuff like that. Um, but it is Horde Night, uh, it is day 49, uh, soon to be Horde Night, and I decided so why not, um, uh, do this one because you guys have only seen the one Horde Night, and it should be starting here fairly soon, in about an hour. I believe that's when it's supposed to start is, is at 9 p.m. And it goes till 4 a.m. I believe that's when it normally starts. It might change. I don't know. But since... Um, the, la this, the last time you guys saw a Horde Knight was the last time I actually did a Horde Knight on the bridge. Because I, <laughs> I got very distracted... I don't know what I was doing. I was probably, like... Because I'm one of those people that when I play video games, if I'm not playing them, like, on camera, um, or, like, doing a stream or something like that, I'll sit and I'll watch YouTube videos or I'll watch, like, movies or TV shows or whatever on my other monitor and play the game at the same time. And so I didn't even notice that it was actually a Horde night, so I just kind of, like... I was over... Cl pretty close to my house so I ended up just kind of fighting the horde knight at my house and I made I, I basically just stayed outside and ran around as much as I could which caused the zombies to spawn in a pretty large area because they didn't I didn't want them to get close enough to my house to have the chance to hit it because, I mean, it, it should, by now, it should, uh, with it being concrete, everything being concrete, uh, it should be able to take quite a bit. Oh. Of course. Did I bring with me a splint? Did not blink bring a splint. Okay, why not? I can survive that. That's fine. But, um... Ooh, it seemed kind of... I guess everything just kind of seems kind of laggy. But... I'm just waiting. This is gone. The, the, so the sucky thing is with the, um... The... Sprained leg. So it, 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 it says four minutes. But that's four minutes real time, not four minutes game in game. Which is kind of annoying. <laughs> oh yeah. We we started hearing this music the other day. This kind of like music. The other day. The last time that I played this. But it was not on a horde night. It was just a random day. And I started hearing this music. And I don't like it. Because it's very... It has very sinister tones to it. And I mean, I guess that's kind of the point. Normally they start from this end. What time do they come? I don't remember. I don't know if it's... It, it's supposed to start at a specific hour because a... Normally a tone. You'll hear a specific tone that basically is like the siren that st you starts off Horde Night, so you know that, oh, okay, everything's starting now. And they start, the, the zombies spawn close to where you are. That's how they've always been. They, they spawn decently close to where you are, and all, like, supposedly... I think it's supposed to be supposedly all the other zombies in the world are drawn closer to your location 
Like, they all get up and start walking towards your location, but, you know, not all of them make it all the way. Or maybe they don't, I don't know, I think that's just... It might have been something that we made up as we were playing. Because that happens quite often, is I, I get these, these thoughts in my head that it's like, yeah, it makes sense that, like, they would design the game this way, or maybe this thing happened... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why those thoughts happen, but they do. I think it's because the way my brain works, I always go and say that, that things can be better. Nothing is perfect. There's no such... There, there can't really ever be perfection. So things can always get better, and there's always room for improvement and the, like for games and movies and stuff there's mo room for updates there's room for like changes and scripts and stuff like that and even with you know movies that already come out uh, or tv shows i'm like that was good but if they made this like one change to the script or whatever a a line or whatever a moment could be so much more intense. But you know, that's just me. I, tr I try and keep a lot of those thoughts internal unless it's like with a friend that there's a sub signal for the beginning of Horde Night. Oh, lovely. I hate the noise they make. It's like the worst deflating balloon of all time. I know what you're, some of you are thinking. You're like, we didn't need a recreation of that. But I think we did. Dramatic effect. It's a crazy thing. So the dogs are not smart enough to jump it. Maybe. I may be completely wrong with that. The zombies, however, are... They're smart enough to go, oh, hey, we can jump up here and start climbing. I hate this ones. I hate little crawly dudes. They suck. There we go. Supposedly, there, there's, there's supposed to be leg shots, they're supposed to be the ability to take out things' legs. In theory. I just don't... Okay. I think the dogs are smart enough to do it. They're just not stable enough to do it. Like, they, they every time they keep trying, they just keep falling down. Like, he keeps, like... Like, he's too wide for that block or something like that. Because, I mean, he does take up a... Oh crap, is there aerial stuff? Don't tell me there's aerial stuff. I would- oh! Bad pup. Bad. I would so hate if there was aerial stuff. Because I am so close to the sky. Because I just- I saw a shadow and it looked like- I didn't see anything that belonged to it. Come on. I like this. I, I got this. Um, I think I used this last time, so I'm just using. I I'm using the marksman rifle, but when things get closer, I can switch over to this. This SMG, which is 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 really nice. I used it for the last um my last horde night, and I, I think I used it most of the night, and just because I had a crap ton of the pistol ammo, and that's what the SMG uses. Oh my, that's horrifying sounding. I, 
I did bring some um, explosive type stuff with me. I brought a couple of like the pipe bombs and stuff because I don't normally use any of the any forms of the high explosives in this game because I don't know I just don't um, but I want to try them I mean I've used them before I think it's just because I do so much house looting and you know with the house looting they're like you're in such close quarters you don't want to use a hand grenade Oh, I supremely hope I do not have as many glowy dudes as the last time, because normally the the spawn of things seems is seems quite random. It's very randomized, but like the dog, the dogs, the dogs aren't really that difficult for me, because you get them with a clean headshot and they're done for. I really don't like those guys though. These guys, they just suck. And it's not even because they're really that difficult. They're not even all that difficult. They're just annoying. I thought I could take you down, Bertha. Oh my god, Bertha. What is with you? There, finally. Oh no. Don't make all the glowy guys the. Oh crap, I hate those guys. I don't even know what's special about those guys. But you just look at them and you're like. Something definitely feels special about those guys. Like they, they feel more powerful. That's why I hate, hate these guys. They're deceiving. You look at him and go, oh, he's like currently stunned and or dead. And all of a sudden the, what you think is dead body goes flying at you. Need to be a little bit more careful with this ammo. I think I do have a good bit still in my truck. I think I have a stack in the... Excuse me? I did not press the switch weapons button. Oh no. I don't know why, but I have... What? Okay. I have weapons that I like to use in different environments. Like, for some reason, I like using the, um, I prefer using the shotgun in the cold biome. I don't know why. I don't think it does anything more or less. I just prefer doing it. Because it just, I, I use it mainly against the lumberjacks because for some reason I think that it's actually being more effective even though it's probably not. She's probably still going to get back up. Oh, no, okay. You can tell whether or not, like, the zombies are dead just because the... They have different, like, amounts of, like, limpness to them. Like that, that was just stunned. And I mean, if it's completely missing its head, normally that means it's dead, but, <laughs> you know. I like you, I think it's just because normally when I deal with the lumberjacks, what I do is I run directly up to them and just... I don't even know why, because normally, I mean, Yes, shotguns are better for for closer range. They're technically like medium range combat, but okay. Okay, 
Okay, I was about to say, that one, the cheerleader, could have still gotten up. Because they do sometimes lose limbs and still get back up. I, I keep, gotta keep checking behind me. Because it seems like they changed up the pattern. I guess they, they would do that with, you know, as long as it goes further. The further along it gets. Because you see there's guys spawning over there. There's, there's coming from both ends, whereas normally it's like, it changes per wave. It'll be like, okay, a couple from, a couple waves from one side, and then a couple waves from the other side. And, but no, I guess they, they changed it up. Now they're coming from all angles. I guess they were doing that the last Horde night I played. I love this. this. This SMG is, is really nice. I never realized how, like, actually really nice the SMG is. Because I don't normally play with it. I get- I- Don't know why there's no general reason. I guess I, I always have the- The thought in mind of, like, you know, playing really silent. But, you know trying to play as silent as possible, so I'd, I would do, melee in this game is awful, or at least I'm just really bad in the, the, at melee in this game. Because I was, I was fine, it, like, really bad. Like, like, a fire axe, you know, that's like, that is, like, a perfect weapon for a zombie apocalypse, wouldn't you think? It's like, it's fairly versatile. You can use it for not just killing zombies, but you cannot use it for killing zombies in this game. I mean, you can, it just, it takes so much longer. The swing takes so much longer. Yeah, I keep checking the top of the bridge occasionally just because of me. You know what the funny thing is? So, the military guys aren't very runny. They don't run much. Which is, which is just funny to me. I enjoy this game because like oh I've played like games like um like Left 4 Dead I've played th that game for years I've got hundreds of hours on that game and it, it's good and it's, it's a pretty good game but it's only really good if you want to like deal with like copious amounts of zombies like all the time and that's what you're completely focused on is just fighting zombies but this one's good because it, it brings out other aspects, and it's like, yeah, there is a good amount of zombie fighting, because, you know, it's the zombie apocalypse, but this, it's just, you need a balance, there's a ratio, but I guess it's just because they're, they're two different types of game. Because that one's a, is a shmup shoot em up game and then there's yeah, Left 4 Dead's like a, a kinda like a shmup game but then there's um this which is more I don't know if I'd necessarily say strategy it's I guess there is a bit of strategy to it but it's just more survival did I hit her? I did hit her I thought I went right over her shoulder that's what I thought I did, but I guess I didn't. It looked like I did. Click, click. I would like to get 
a higher level rifle. Because that would just be nice, you know? <laughs> I think things only go up to level 6. I want to say that's how high of levels there are for things. I don't know. They're, I mean, yeah, okay, now they're all spawning on that side of the bridge. But, like... Oh, I guess it's because I'm down here. If I was up here, they'd go up the bridge. So I was questioning, I'm like, why are they all doing that instead of... Um... They're all, they're all going through the river, and I was questioning why they're going through the river. Because I was down there. If I wasn't down there, then they would have... Uh, they would go up here. They'd come up this way. I want to say... No, okay. I was thinking for a minute, I'm like, is maybe one of these sides still, like, fully... Intact, but new. None of the sides are still fully intact. There. How did you just spit at me at an angle, sir? Oh, he's mad. Okay. I'm like I downed him once. Up, oh, twins. <laughs> I would have, I, I would like it, okay, so the, the head explosion and, like, any sort of limb explosion in this game, um, means that it's a critical, so, you know, oh, crap, I forgot, those, oh, so those guys can explode as well, like, they not only spit crap, but they explode. I keep getting, so it, it, I'm recording, it's almost 2 a.m. Um, on January 1st, so it's, it's 2020 now, um, and the, my, I, I keep seeing, like, things for my different friends and for Steam keep popping up. Oh no, there's two of them? Look at that. Cool. Starting to run out of pistol ammo. Doink. A doink. I guess I'll have to make more. No, I don't. I'm joking. I don't have to make more. I have plenty of it at home. I got stacks on stacks on stacks of it. Would you stop that? Uh -oh. That's crazy. Look at that. Don't explode. Okay. I was shooting the guy behind him. Cause there was a guy, yeah, there was this guy behind him. But, yay. Another horde knight down. Okay, cool. Oh. I'm gonna get home, I guess. I guess if I had not moved. Maybe if I had moved. Because I, I tried to move to get into the water, but didn't fully get into the water. Because I believe water reduces the fall damage. Oh no. You can't run, you can't... You can't do anything. Uh. Okay, well. Oh yeah, and I'm starting to have I'm starting to have problems with getting enough gas for stuff. 
because, like, I keep to uh, tear apart cars and stuff like that, but I don't, I haven't found much oil shale or anything like that, and I wish, God, this is so loud, I don't know, there needs to be just the ability to change how loud the truck is, like, change the vehicle noise levels, but no, but, um, and, like, it's loud no matter what, but, um, what is, what was I gonna say, I wish I could take gas out of different things, like, if I could take gas out of the, um, out of the, the gyrocopter, and then out of these, um, these generator banks, I, I totally would. I'd take the, the gas out of them and put them in the truck, because I use the truck out of most out of everything. Oh my gosh. I completely forgot to bring a splint with me. Because normally, I when I, I try and take, I think, okay, I'll need, um, these certain things, and one of those certain things that I think I'll need is a splint, or a splint or two, because, you know, I'm standing on top of a bridge, and if I fall off, then I'll need that. I don't even think I technically brought those antibiotics. I think I picked those up. I normally bring antibiotics, because then I'll just, I'll cure myself right then and there, rather than waiting. Oh, this is a, um... I've, I've, I've started reorganizing some things, um, because it just makes things easier. Uh, boop. Now I'll go put some of this stuff away. There we go. Cuts that down, down in like half. So I'll put that in there. Uh, boop, boop, boop. See, I told you, I've got, I've got plenty of handgun ammo. But I'm going to say I'm going to cut this one here. So we made it through another horde night, which is nice. Um, I may just because the zombies don't go away. They don't just go away. Um, I'm going to work on the I'm still working on the turret sy system um, because I'm still trying to figure out the electrical system stuff for that. Um, and I want to make it. I'm trying to figure out this music, but I'm trying to use the battery bank that I have, and I can make battery banks and stuff now. I've made a couple, or I've, yeah, yeah, I've made a couple, um, and then see what else I can do. Um, I'm working on getting more levels because levels, like I said, the levels take, if I were to, like, take and calculate out how many different zombie zombies I'd have to kill to get that much XP would be close to, I want to say at least close to 100 or possibly even more. Um, but that's the amount I need until the next level because I did just level up that night. This last, this past night. How many zombies have I killed so far? Ooh, close to 2,000. Um, but yeah. And then I was, I was working on upgrading the stuff for this because this allows me to make better rifles and stuff because I love using the marksman rifles. Um, doo -doo -doo. Anything else I can think of? Oh, but no, what I was saying is the zombies don't go away, so there's no real point in trying to just hide in your house for a, a horde night. I mean, I guess it's just because I've never really done it. I've never really just tried to hide in my house for a horde night. I guess I could try that maybe. I definitely want to move a whole bunch of stuff. I'd want to move all, like, most of my, um, boxes and basically, like, wall off a whole bunch of stuff so that they can't get to it because they can break your boxes. I'm pretty certain they can break your boxes. Since they can break basically any block, they can't, sh they should be able to break your boxes. Oh yeah, I forgot I had this, this chest over here. Well, that's good. But I am all the time for this one. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.